Justin Brownlee shares with 2OT the top four imports that nakalaban niya in his PBA career. Oh, you got to put Alan Durham in there. He's been, you know, uh, great. I probably played him the most as well. And to be honest, probably the toughest, you know. Uh, he's very, uh, very powerful, you know, very dominant inside. And he's always, you know, put up great numbers for his team. And also, uh, you know, been a great leader from Morocco. So you got to put him in there. Tatlong beses nakatapat ni Brownlee si Durham in the PBA Finals of the Governor's Cup. Which means they have faced off 21 times already. Brownlee emerged victorious in the 2016, 2017, and 2019 Governor's Cup Finals. Alan Durham has yet to return to the PBA dahil kasalukuyan siyang naglalaro sa Japanese B-League sa pagsisimula ng Governor's Cup. Uh, Terrence, Terrence Jones, you know, former NBA guy. Um, definitely was uh, great with talking text and uh, if I'm not mistaken, the best importer uh, of that conference in 2019, maybe? Yeah, 2019. So you got to put him up there. Um, but uh, was it more difficult going up against the bigger imports of the Commissioner's Cup, like Terrence Jones? Uh, yeah, but I would say, you know, I'm very fortunate. You know, we got some really good import stoppers. Uh, you know, Joe, when he was, you know, that time he was healthy and he he did, he did always did a great job. You know, of course, Jaffet, you know, with his size and length, he, he had the gun. And I think he was doing really well, you know, uh, and also Greg, you know. So he was he was with us and he was always doing great too. But uh, How tough is it dealing with a guy that big but still that versatile in, in Terrence Jones? Yeah, it's tough. I mean, I can see why, you know, definitely see why he in the NBA. And I, I feel like even guys in the NBA probably had trouble with him. You know, you don't see that too often, you know, a guy that can dribble, you know, pass the way he can. I, even in the NBA, you know, you see a lot, you probably see a lot more. But still, I think it's very rare a guy this size that can do what he can do, you know. Uh, and as well, guys like, uh, you know, my brother Baltimore, you know, played with him in ABL and then played against him in the PBA. You know, he was definitely tough, you know, with his, his skill set, being able to rebound, run the court, you know, flash around the basket, and being able to shoot as well. You know, he was, t he was definitely one up there. And, um, oh, who else, man? Romeo Travis, oh, man. Wow. Still have nightmares about him, man. Yeah, but he was still, I remember he closed us out in the semis 2000 and, I was 18. 18, yeah. 18, he had that 50 point game, man. Shout out to him, man. He's pretty great. And um, they won the championship, right? Yeah, yeah, they won the championship. So shout out to those guys, man. I think, you know, uh, those two guys definitely Romeo Travis, Baltimore, Allen Durham, and um, Jones. Was mm -hmm.